Yeah, hello there from Olympia. We are in the capital today where a couple of state-run organizations are hoping local students will elect to defend our state against invasive species. There's a lot of them out there. We're talking about the vegetation, the critters, the bugs, even the animals and pathogens that simply don't belong here and pose a serious risk to our state. So I work for the Washington Invasive Species Council, which is a cross-section of all the different types of organizations that are charged with preventing and stopping invasive species. And we're partnering with the Washington Department of Fish and Wildlife to raise awareness of some of the worst invasive species that are either just getting established in our state or that are on the horizon that we want to keep out. And so we are uh, hoping that high schoolers will help us with our educational campaign we have a new trailer that the Department of Fish and Wildlife has available, but we need assistance with wrapping it with educational materials. So we're seeking uh, graphic designers to, to highlight some species that are priorities, as well as actions that the public can take to help us keep these out of Washington State. The number one thing that we're trying to keep out of our state are invasive freshwater quagga and zebra mussels. It's hitchhikers on watercraft. And so we can see on the pipes, for example, over a series of months, the pipes begin to close, kind of like a clogged artery. And so we have watercraft inspectors at our borders that are looking at watercraft coming toward Washington to ensure that these invasive mussels aren't hitchhikers on that watercraft. And we were able to actually procure and train two different canines in Washington. They're actually both rescue dogs. So we were able to rescue them, give them a job, and they're now protecting our state from all these negative consequences of the invasive species. And now the students turn digital artists can submit their ideas through your website where you also have an extensive list of these invasive species. And um, the neat thing is that those winning submissions will actually wrap that trailer and then travel our state.